tried to do shabby chic heart um, and this is actually supposed to be I don't know it's like it, it has hangers so you can put it on the wall or something and uh, this is my design team project for Natasha scrapbook corner on um, Zipit and 90-95% uh, uh, of goodies here is from Natasha's store I was using only burlet and that Zibit um, to create this heart so like you see um, I sold this um, heart from um, burlet actually it's light color burlet and um, so what I did, um, I, it's you can put it like you can use it like pin cushion, but whatever you want, it's all soft. And I was not using glue, uh, hot glue gun because I want when it's soft. I want when you can stick your pins if you want to use it like stick pins. Uh, you, it, it will be easy go through. So let me explain here what I was using. Okay, first of all, of course, my old time favorite trim. Uh, Venus Lace Stream, and as usually, I will put link below to direct to this page. And then I was using this stream, also Venus Stream. She has black, I think, black and white color of that, as uh, same like this. And then I was using a uh, Chinese, uh, Chinese um, um, braid uh, trim. Um, on the back you will see this blue, beautiful beautiful applique and few flowers what is from my stash and um, this um, leaves what is come usually in package I think six of them uh, also Natasha has very cool um, for this design particular project Natasha has very beautiful birds big size and uh, tiny tiny small size I was using here just big size I will show you and then I was using um, um, her um, belts uh, it came from the package and then this beautiful tiny tiny um, okay let me show you you will see it here see this beautiful tiny flowers it came from the kit and of course that embellishments like hearts, bow and leaves here. So okay, this is what all I was using. So let me show you very quick. So on the edges, all around I put this uh, this uh, trim and because it's corners, so for example here and here and here on the corners you cannot uh, turn it nicely so I just cut that flower and then I was able to uh, see, for example, here, see, you can see I cut flowers and then it gave me nice corners. Then it was here. And um, then um, uh, I created this piece separate. So uh, my sewing machine, I can do embroidery. But if you guys cannot put, do, cannot, your machine cannot... Uh, do embroidery you can stamp on the fabric you can put uh, paper whatever you want I just did embroidery here and for purpose I put it black I just wanted to give it accent and then around this word I stitched this word uh, to the to my thing before I put the heart together so you can see I stitch it so then uh, around that I put zipper and if you see my zipper kind of like already had this little punches um, and then I put it little um, stickles um, right there where's this edges so this batch color um, zipper and then here I put in the I put like a cut what I was using I was using our um, cotton uh, cotton lace of what Natasha store has also um, then this belt came from the uh, came from the package um, it's Natasha has a couple of sets so this came from the one of that sets a same like this uh, tiny acrylic flowers you can see them they are very very beautiful the, the um, I had only like um, ivory color um, 
palette so I painted them with um, not with acrylic paint with um, you know um, pencils so I um, used my pencils and here I made this beautiful flower using Natasha lace and this is Natasha's uh, Natasha's embellishments. She has, you can buy two of them, four of them, different sets, and this beautiful uh, leaf. But I really, really like it. And here I created little a uh, little bouquet. So this is Natasha's flowers. This acrylic flowers from my stash, and it's um, uh, um. Uh, like a pearl, flat black pearl, heart shape uh, pearl and this is birdie what I was talking about I really like how this bird came here and this is my stick pin and uh, what is good about that bow what Natasha has in her stores this bow has already holder so you can use it like stick pins or just on your project whatever you want and of course same uh, um, leaves here I put two of them so on the edges I put this uh, ivory color um, uh, uh, Chinese Chinese uh, trim here and on the back I was using this beautiful beautiful um, applique here if you can see and it's just perfect here because it's uh, just V shape um, because it's back, I didn't want to go crazy here. I just uh, had like um, my own uh, uh, applique, so I stick this applique, and on in the middles I put rhinestones. Um, I had this from my stash. It's actually sets. Actually, it's you can buy them separate. So and um, I sold them to the heart, and here I just. Um, Added the same hearts on the both sides and uh, let me unzoom so you guys can see it more so this is how it looks so I didn't edit anything here because I wanted to give um, attention only to the heart not to the inner so this is my um, try for shabby chic, uh, shabby chic heart what I created um, using all Natasha's goodies and it's very simple very quick uh, project and I like how it's turned out so hopefully someday uh, maybe it will be in my room maybe not <laughs> okay guys um, have a great day